Hey guys, it's Hey Sophia and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys three really easy and simple Mesa biome designs for starter houses. So all my designs are based on things in real life that you will find in a Mesa biome, so let's get started. So my first design here, I built a little cliff face, so I just mined out this area. It works out quite well because all the materials that you mine you can then use in building your house so you're not having to go around and collect a lot of materials. Now my first design here is based on the native Indian cliff houses that you can find in the USA. They're really really beautiful so that's what I'm doing for my first design. All you want to be doing is just working off the cliff face that you've built. You just want to be building this very big rectangular shape. And this will form the base of your house today. Now I'm just filling in the walls with the red sandstone block that you would have mined. And then I'll also just level out the roof on the inside. Now I'm going to be doing a few windows on the front of my house and my door frame. You want your windows and your doorway to be very like square and rectangular in shape to keep with the theme of the shape of the actual building. And I'm also going to add some details at the bottom of my windows with just some staircases. Now you could use a glass paint for your windows but I think that's a little less realistic to what they would have had back when they built these houses. So I am going to use the spruce fence posts to my windows. Also because these are starter houses, they're based around PVE builds, so you, will, you are going to have mobs, so you do need to fill in your windows. And then for a little bit more fun and a little bit more detail, I'm just going to add a second section to this house. I'm just going to do a like rectangle on my side here and add a couple windows just like the first build. Again, details underneath the windows and filling in with the fence posts. And I'm also just going to add this detail on top of the windows. Because you, you don't want these to look too plain, so the details you want to do is in the style of the blocks that you do. So I'm also adding some smooth redstone blocks to my build. This just kind of makes it look like it's had a little bit of human intervention in the build. Not so much that these blocks were there and you've just carved a hole into them, if that makes sense. But that is pretty much the base of your house done. I'm going to add a few more details. The first thing I'm going to do is just replace some of these natural like sandstone blocks here with sand. This is because you want to try and make your house stand out as much as you can and because it is a sandstone house, you don't want lots of sandstone around it. So. I'm just removing a few of the blocks here to make the house stand out a little bit more. And then for a little bit more detail, I will also be adding to my house a little pathway out the front which I'll add some fence posts as well. I'll be doing a spruce door and I will just level out the floors on the inside. Now as for the interiors, I'm going to leave it up to you how you would like to fill your starter house. I have done a video before on the best things that you should be putting in a starter house in Minecraft to get ahead in the game, so I will link that down below on what you should be putting in your starter house. Just some fence posts now and there we go. So that's pretty much your first house done here. It's a very simple one, very effective and I think it's really cool looking for a starter house. Now my next design is again suited for the Mesa biome and it is a old western style saloon. So if a lot of you have been watching my videos you know I really like the like the saloons for like starter homes and Mesa biomes in general. They're really really easy to build but really effective and look cool. If you had a bunch of friends and you built a bunch of these little houses they'll look really cute and like you would have like a really cute little village. So the base of your house here, you want to go six blocks by six blocks and you want to be going four blocks high for this house. I am doing a mix of the spruce block and the dark oak block for my build, but you can use whatever wood is available to you. 
Maybe you're really nearby a forest so you use the oak block and the birch block. It's just up to you. Use whatever trees are nearby and available. That's the whole point of these houses. So I'm going to fill in my walls now. I did just make a little deck there with some upside down spruce staircases. This will form the deck of the front of our saloon house. And I'm just going to go ahead now, fill in the floor and add some windows and doorways. Okay, and now that that's done, we're going to go ahead and start the front. So you want to grab some dark oak fence posts and make this little railing here and go two blocks high on top of it. Then on top of the house at the front, we're going to make those kind of like saloon little sign fronts that you do see. So you just want to use some dark oak blocks and these staircases on the end. We're then going to add a slab on top of these just to add a little bit more height and also a little roof covering for our deck. But this is a really really simple and cute way to build a little saloon house. For the roof of the saloon I'm just going to use these slabs and just continue along the top here. You can use whatever roof you like though if you want something with a little bit more detail and a little bit of a more pointy shape to it you can do that as well. Now I'm just adding some staircases below my windows for more detail. Another great way to add some detail in this little house would to be adding some staircases just in amongst the planks. This will just give the look of the house being worn and old which would really suit the Mesa like wild saloon style here. Just a couple more windows now for some more detail. But that is pretty much your house done. Now it is a really simple house and it's it's really cute for a starter house but if you had a bunch of friends and you all built this it would be a really cute little community village. Last details, I'm just going to add a little path out the front with a few fence posts and then just put a couple of cactuses around as well. But there you go, so that is how to build the second starter house, really easy, really simple one that looks really cool in a Mesa bio. My next and final house is another one that's based off native Indian designs because these were houses in Mesa biomes so I think it looks really cool. Now this one is based off the Navajo tribe in Native America so this is a traditional style house for them. Now they use actual like uh, red clay, red dirt for these style houses and they build them in this like circular shape so that's what I'm going to go for today. Now this is a really really simple house and it's another house where if you had a bunch of you and friends building these houses it would be really quite effective. Now I'm just building this really random circle shape so you can build whatever circle shape you like. I think the whole point with these kind of houses is you want to be making them look really kind of like rustic and old so you don't want them perfect. Don't worry too much about building a perfect circle shape just work by eye and just randomly like just put one down on the ground. You then just want to kind of go up and up and up until you have this dome shape just like I'm building at the moment. Again, don't worry about it being perfect. You don't want it to be perfect so it looks really good when it's more rusticy looking. But that's pretty much the base of your house now. Now these houses had a oak like little archway at the front like a support beam which is what I've got there for mine and the inside of the houses were actually lined as well with oak so I'm going to go inside now and use the oak logs and just line the inside of my house to get the really authentic look that these houses had. Now this is something that you do not have to do if you don't have the materials don't worry about it you don't even have to do it if you do not like the look of it that's fine I'm just trying to keep these as authentic as I possibly can. Now 
Now I am going to add a doorway there just because you do want a doorway to keep mobs out. I think they typically use fabric for their doorways back then but I'm just going to use an oak door so it's simple. But that's pretty much the house. Now all you can really do from now on is just add some slabs and stuff like that to add a little more, bit more detail if you would like detail. But yeah. But there we go. So I just played around and added a few more slabs. But there is how to build three really easy and really simple realistic biome styled houses for the Mesa biome in Minecraft. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And like always guys, thank you!